Hey everyone, it is your boy Blazy here bringing you a brand new video this fine Saturday afternoon. So I hope everyone enjoyed the live video yesterday. My voice is a little bit raspy from doing so, but it was a load, a load of fun. And we are going to continue to bring the vibes into today's video, people, because we are going to go strong with a brand new box opening today. And it's the second time we have opened these. We are going to be opening a whole box of Panini World Cup 2022 stickers. And not only that, the exclusive US box, which contains those crazy rare coloured parallel stickers. And just like the last video, people, we are going to be hunting for those black one of one stickers. Messi might have already been found, but Ronaldo and Mbappe, they're still up there to hunt for. And those cards are going to be worth some serious wonga. We're talking possibly 50,000 plus if you get a Ronaldo or Mbappe sticker. So I am absolutely hyped to get 50 more sticker packs opened in today's video as we hunt for those exclusive black one of one stickers. So we are going to crack this bad boy open and not waste any time in doing so today, people. So if you enjoy today's video, people, then make sure you smash that like button and do subscribe never to miss another soccer card or sticker opening from your boy Blazy. We do it three times a week and we open every single collection. So uh, hit that subscribe button if you want to see more. But for now, sit back and relax, people, and let's see if we can hear a black one of one in today's video. Here we go, people. Here is the box of US exclusive World Cup 2022 stickers. And I tell you what, people, I am vibed so hard right now to get this bad boy open because we are looking for those black one of one parallels. And like I said, an Mbappe, a Ronaldo, they are going for serious cash on eBay uh, if you end up packing one of them. So that is what we're hoping for from today's video. You can see we've got a number of parallels available. We've got the blue, red, purple, green and black with black being exclusive one of one stickers. So for those of you new to this, there is only one of them uh, in the entire world, which is pretty cool. And I was just going to see if I can see the odds on here, people. Uh, I don't think the odds are stated on the box. Here we go. Blues are one in two. Reds are one in 26 packs. Purples one in 205. Green in one in 1,445. And black parallels are probably like one in 10, one in 20,000 packs. So exceptionally rare stuff, people. Last time out, and I'll tag the video right up in the corner now, you can see we managed to get a red Gareth Bale, a red Valverde, and a red Giovanni Lo Celso. And while he was still in a little bit of form, Trent Alexander-Arnold Blues. So three reds from one box is really good. But today, we want a black one of one, or if not, at least a green or purple. So a little bit rarer than we managed last time. If we don't get anything better than a red, I will be a little bit annoyed, people. I won't lie. I'll be a little bit annoyed. Uh, and just for those of you in the US that are looking for these, you can get it in Walmart, Target, and Walgreens from what I can see. And it's about 65 bucks per box. If you're in the UK, you're going to pay a little bit more. You'll have to get them from eBay. But I think around... If I'm honest, because they've got to be important and whatnot, £80 is probably a decent price for a box of 50 packs. Uh, I've seen them going for 100 For me, guys, it's a little bit too much. A one-on-one -on -one exchange rate, you're looking at about 80 quid uh, if you're in the UK and wanted to crack open a box of these. So I have got plenty more of these in stock, people. So as we get closer to the World Cup, we'll open more. We'll do more one-on-one -on -one hunts. Uh, so like I said earlier, do subscribe uh, if you don't want to miss those. So for now, people, we are going to get ripped into this box of stickers for today's video as we look for those one of one stickers. Look, the box is a little bit tatty this time out, but we have got plenty, plenty of packs uh, to be getting open. So for those of you who open the UK stickers, you can't get the extra stickers over in the US, so we won't see any extra stickers in today's video, but we will see some really nice numbered parallels, hopefully. So let's get ripping, people. First pack of 50. Have we got a coloured sticker to start off today's video? Let's find out. We start with Robert Lewandowski as our first card, the absolute beast that he is. Uh, we'll put him in the base pile. First hollow is the German uh, national emblem. I actually haven't got that one, so we're definitely taking that as a dub for our first gold of today's video. Uh, we've then got ourselves Yannick Carrasco. Oh, we've spoiled the blue already. The problem with these stickers is they're very fiddly. Uh, it's very different to opening stickers than it is cards. Uh, much, much more tricky to get their sleight of hand. Uh, we're going to spoil it anyway. we are finish off with an Andre Silva, nothing too special, but a blue parallel from our first packs. And like I said, people, these are every one in two packs. So first blue of the day is an Andre Silva blue sticker. So one parallel down, 49 more packs to go, 49 more chances at finding a black one of one. And preferably, Ronaldo or Mbappe would be the ones that we'd ideally like. So moving on into the next one, people, we've got Imran Luza of Morocco. 
We've got Cash Michael, now of Nice uh, and Denmark. We've got an Alan Miri, a Matthias Klitsch, and our final sticker is a blue boy. So every one in two packs, a Serbian player. Vlahovic would be nice. Uh, Vlahovic or Mitrovic. Three, two, one, people. It is Milenkovic. I think this is like my fourth blue Serbian sticker. Uh, I might be able to actually stick all the blue Serbians in the album soon, which would be pretty cool. Uh, but second blue sticker of the day, people. Nikola Milenkovic of Serbia. So two packs, two blue parallels. Nothing too spicy so far. They're not big name players, are they? Uh, or big ticket players, we could say. But hey, 48 more packs. 48 more packs. 48 more times we are going to be vibing as we work our way through today's video. So next pack, people. Can we keep the parallel hype going? We've got Daniel Vass of Switzerland. We've got the Brazilian Crest. Again, one I'm looking for for my sticker album. Back-to-back -back crests, people. Look at that. That is pretty cool. Uh, to get back-to-back -back gold stickers. We are taking that, people. We are taking that. Uh, we've got the uh, Iranian emblem here. Uh, I almost read out the text on there instead. Uh, we've then got double Iranian. So we've got Eshan Hashafi. And a white sticker to end it, Frankie de Jong. So unfortunately, people, uh, Frankie de Jong is what we end that pack on. No coloured parallels coming up in that one. Oh, our first L of the day. Uh, first L of the day, people, but plenty more stickers to go. So let's keep the vibes coming, people. So we've got ourselves Giovanni Reina. We've got Anguissa. I think I've got him like five times now. Uh, we've got Kudus. I've already spoiled the back one again. We've got Mori of Mexico. And we finish with another blue for Croatia. It's not Modric, I don't think, because of the trim. Three, two, one. It is Duje Kaleta Car of Croatia. Uh, from our next pack. Three blues now, people. From a pack of uh, a box of 50 stickers, we should be expecting 25 blues on average. So three blues already secured. No coloured parallels yet uh, that are any better than blue. So keeping it coming, keeping it coming. What have we got in the next pack, people? We have got Joshua Kimmich. We've got Thibaut Courtois. We've got Hatem of Qatar. A... Stefan de Vridge of the Netherlands. I only got like two Netherlands stickers last time out. I did a box of these. And we finish off with a base. And the base is Matt Turner, I believe, the USA goalkeeper. Uh, I'm going to move the base pile out because this pile is going to get incredibly messy uh, as we work through the video, uh, which definitely is a good thing. And we're just going to leave the golds and we're going to leave the colour parallels uh, in focus for you guys to take a look at. You guys don't want to look at the boring stuff. You're going to see plenty of base in today's video. We want to be focusing on what these big hits are, people. So we start off with a Romelu Lukaku uh, of Inter Milan and Belgium. We've got Mohadami, the South Korean crest, I believe that is. I have already got that one. We've got Leon Goretzka, and we finish off with a Marquinhos of Brazil. So no colour parallels in that pack. No colour parallels right there. Come on, people. We are looking... For those big ticket parallels, let's go. Let's send it with this pack, people. We've got Pasalic, and I've spoiled it already. We've got Waturo Endo. It's because these stickers like almost stick together. There's almost a little bit of like, I don't know what the people in the US put on stickers as well. The UK stickers are like, they're barely sticky, which makes it really easy to put in the album. You guys in the US have like zero regulations around sticky stuff. Like these stickers can honestly like rip your skin off. Uh, but either way, they're like, they get a lot of friction in the pack or something. They're really hard to pull apart. Uh, but anyway, we then got Um Gue, and we finish off with an older player, 1986. I'm trying to think how old Ronaldo is. He's about, hmm, could be Ronaldo. Could be Ronaldo, 1986, an older player. Croatia. I want to say, I would say Modric, but I don't think it is. Kayla Navas, it's not Croatia. I misread that one. It is Costa Rica. I am always getting Costa Rica and Croatia messed up. Uh, but hey, here we have it. We got a Kayla Navas of Costa Rica. Blue parallel there, people. So next one coming up. Uh, I will get that flag right the next time round. Moving on to this next pack. What have we got here, people? We've got Nahu uh, of Cameroon. Kingsley Coman. Won an awful lot in his uh, career, but doesn't start a lot of games. Um, right there, we've got Edison Cavani. Looks a bit like a matador, doesn't he, with that um, moustache and trim going on. You can see I've modelled myself off Cavani. Just can't quite get that uh, facial hair going. Uh, we then got Mohamed Cano. And we finish off with base. And Mario Pasalic uh, of Croatia. Next one, people. Next one. Here we go. The problem with some of these packs as well, right, is that you can almost see the colour parallel as you open it. And there's no way of hiding it because you can't shuffle the sticker around in the uh, pack like you can with cards. But 
It is what it is. We move, we move. So we got one of the Hernandez brothers, Lucas Hernandez. First team sticker of the day with Denmark. Again, you can see these stickers are like stuck together, which is annoying. Uh, we've got Ali G Galizade, Paulson of Denmark. And the blue sticker It's another Croatian. Um, 1994. Ooh, I don't know who I'm going to pick on this one. I'm trying to think of Croatian players that I know. We're just going to go for it on three. Let's just go on three. Three, two, one. Oh, Mateo Kovacic. I should have remembered Kovacic. That's poor form by me, people. But we got a Mateo Kovacic of Croatia as our next blue sticker. Five blue stickers uncovered so far, people. Nothing rarer, uh, which is disappointing. But hopefully we're saving that big hit for later on in today's video. Right, we've got ourselves Goncalo Guedes of Portugal. The Netherlands badge, one that I'm looking for, which is really handy. We've got Jeremy Sarmiento of Ecuador. A Almoez Ali. And another blue of Tunisia. So it's not going to be a big name player. 3 2 1. It is Farouk Ben Mustafa. Blue parallel for Tunisia. Right there, people. So another blue. Not a black, not a green, not a purple. Even a red at the moment wouldn't be bad. But I'd rather save our colours for something a little bit spicier than a red. So Darko Lazovic is up next of Serbia. Ivan Perisic of Croatia. Hassan Al Hiados of Morocco or Qatar, even. Uh, my apologies. We've got Nicolas de la Cruz and a base to finish. The base is Nico Elvedi of Switzerland. People, people, where are these rare parallels? Where are the rare parallels? We're almost through like our first 10 packs, I think, and we've still not found ourselves a rare parallel. So let's keep this going, people. Leandro Paredes is up next. Whenever there's a coloured in it, people, they stick together. And it is so, so annoying, as I don't want to give the game away, but I've already given it away again. We've got Aaron Ramsdale. We've got Jaziri of Tunisia. We've got Pavlovic of Serbia. And we finish off with the Tunisian team blue sticker. Look at that, people. The blue Tunisian team uh, is our first blue team sticker today as well. Not happy with these. And you can see you can't shuffle these rounds in the packs, which is really, really, really annoying. Um, because you can't quite get the stickers to all line up. It does my head in. I don't want to give the game away uh, with what we've got hiding at the back, but uh, it is what it is. And again, I've ruined it anyway, but it's base. It's base, so that doesn't matter. So we've got Harry Suta. We've got Amir Ab Abedzade. We've got Danilo. God, he's been playing for a while now. 2011, 1991. We share the same birthday, not the same birth year, but me and Danilo were both born on the 15th of July. For you people in the US, that must confuse you. That is the right way to put a date down, people. Day, month, year. None of this month, day, biz year business. 15th of July, me and Danilo share the same birthday. That is really, really cool. i uh, got the Moroccan team uh, and we got Yassine Mariah. So... Nothing coming up in that pack there. Let's keep it going, keep it going. 11 minutes in, people. 11 minutes in. Still to find something bad, bad and bougie from today's video. We've got Jonathan Osorio of Canada. Brendan Aronson. A Tyler Adams of the USA. He's not looking at the camera there, is he? Uh, we've got Andre Ayu of Ghana. And I think two stickers again got stuck together. They did. We've got a Sylvan Vidma of Switzerland that was stuck there in the middle. I tell you what, you don't get this problem with the UK packs, people, I'm telling you. For you guys in the US watching this, the UK packs seem to be better put together. Um, some of the UK stickers, to be fair, are the wrong sizes. Like, I've gone stick a few stickers in my album, and they're, like, cut short. Um, but, hey, yeah, the ones in the US packs seem to be, like, almost, like, stuck together as you take them out, which is annoying. But, hey, is what it is. So, we then move to Australia with AOM Mobile. We've got another IU for Ghana. Nicholas Gonzalez of Argentina. Genki Haraguchi of Japan. And final stick is a base. A base Harry Maguire. I personally wouldn't be taken to Maguire based on the World Cup, based on form. I think I wouldn't be taking a lot of the current England team to the World Cup based on form. For me right now, there are a lot of problems with that England team. Southgate always said he'd never pick a team based on the name. But that's definitely what he's doing right now. If Tony, Tamori, Abraham aren't coming for the World Cup, there is something, something wrong with that, in my opinion. Um... But I'm not the England manager. I'm not the England manager. Right. Diego Jota is up next. We've got Sadio Mane, former Liverpool teammates right there. Again, the stickers are stuck together in a coloured parallel pack. We've got Oviedo of Costa Rica, a Jao Moutinho, and our blue parallel is of the USA, which is pretty cool. There'll be a lot of USA fans watching this. Let's take a look. 3-2-1. Brendan Aronson, blue parallel 
for the United States of America. Look at that. I called it America there, America. Uh, there we go. So keeping it going, keeping it going. Still to find anything really rare from today's video, which is annoying. But hey, maybe they're hidden at the back. Maybe we we'll have to swap the sides of the box over. Maybe we'll start coming from this side of the box this time. So Danny Olmo of Spain. We've got Musab Kadir. We've got ourselves Ivica Ivusic. A Aziz Behic of Australia. It's a blue again to finish, which is annoying. A blue Dane. I reckon it's Schmeichel. 3 2 1. No, Pierre Emil Hoiberg is our blue parallel from Denmark. So that takes us up to, and if I move the golds out of the way quickly, we'll just slide them over to one side. Uh, we're up to nine blues. Nine blue parallels so far today, people, from the video itself. Um, nothing rare. No big name players in there either so far. This has definitely been a weaker box so far uh, compared to what I opened a few weeks ago. Like I said, I tagged that one at the beginning of the video, people. So if you guys want to watch box opening one, uh, then do go take a look after this video. So another Nico Elvedi uh, of Switzerland. Again, these are stuck. We've got Matthias Vigna of Uruguay. The Tunisian team without the blue border. So we've got both now. We then got a gold Switzerland badge, I believe. Um... To, a bit Switz team badge and 1989 base Daniel Vass of Denmark. Almost said Switzerland there of Denmark. Some of you guys have commented before and gone, you've got the nation wrong. Sometimes you do get the nation wrong when you are opening packs at this speed. Honestly, people, I love football. I watch so much football. I like to think I know my teams, uh, but sometimes when you're going at this speed, mistakes do happen. But I think we've been all right so far. I think we've been all right uh, as we move into this pack. So, Ghana, we've got Jonathan Mensah. We've got Tejon Buchanan of Canada. Definitely a team to watch this World Cup. Matthew Leckie. We've got a Leiduni of Tunisia. And another blue to finish. 1996. Spain. <sighs> Could be anyone this, couldn't it? Alvaro Morata. Rodri! Biggest player of the day. Biggest blue of the day right there, people. We have got Rodri of Spain and Manchester City. So a blue Rodri is definitely, I think, our best player pool so far from today's video. Spain, have they got a chance of winning the World Cup? Obviously, they've got a chance of winning the World Cup. Would I put them amongst the favourites? For me, no. Favourites for this World Cup, Brazil, uh, France are definitely in there with a shout. Um, yeah, I'd say Brazil, France are looking good for me. Other than that, I'm struggling. Maybe Argentina. Argentina always in with a good shot. Messi's final tournament too. Brazil, Argentina... Uh, or France are my picks for the World Cup. I don't think Spain are going to be in the mixer. Neither will England. I'm an England fan, and that pains me to say it. Uh, we've got Yassine Mariah. Whatever sticker at the back, by the way, people, is thicker than the rest of these. We've got Alisson. We've got Kobel. We've got Sergio Busquets. And we finish off with an Idrissa Gay. And again, Panini quality issues right there, people. Look at that. The sticker is wider behind. Uh, if I push these in, get to about there. Yeah, look at it. You can see it's wider. Panini quality control, people. Going very, very well, as you can see over at the factory. Um, yeah, that's really, really annoying. But hey-ho, I have actually, um, I just bin the stickers. If they're the wrong size for the album, especially where I said we've had problems here in the UK, I've just bin the sticker. I'm not sticking a gammy sticker in the album. You love looking back on the World Cup sticker album and being like, oh, doesn't it look good? Uh, but it won't look good if you stick dead, misshapen stickers in. So Giovanni de Celso coming up right next, people. We've got a Thomas Delaney of Denmark. We've got David Junior Hoylet of Canada still playing as well. He's been around for a while. We've got Nemanja Guzlej. And we finish off with a Mexican blue. Oh, Lozano would be nice, wouldn't it? A Lozano blue would be really good. Three, two, one. Jesus Manuel Corona of Mexico. Blue parallel. As we go up to parallel number 11 from today's video. God, we're almost halfway through this pack as well. Or through this box. Still not found anything to uh, anything to shout about, really, if I'm honest. Uh, as we hit Jordi Alba in this. Could you believe it? Jordi Alba's in place since 2011. He was rapid back in the day, wasn't he, people? We've got Noah Kafour. We've got Saliki of Cameroon. Phil Foden of England. And we finish off with Eiji Kawashima of Japan. Next pack, next pack. As you like to see, people, I know the last video went on for ages. So I'm trying to be a little bit quicker. Uh, as we rip through this sticker pack today uh, and see if we can get that black one of one parallel. Right, Cesar Montez of Mexico, Jason Lee, Kevin De Bruyne with like a colour parallel to De Bruyne. Uh, probably his last World Cup as well, so we'd definitely like one of those. We've got Atiba Hutchinson, 
Another blue, it's Iranian. Again, it's not going to be a big hit. Taremi's the only Iranian I can remember off the top of my head. Three, two, one. It is Alizrezi Byvranand of Iran. So, again, nothing crazy on that. Nothing, you know, I mean, there's not a lot to write home about so far. These colour parallels have not been good. Uh, I definitely picked one good box so far and one dead box from Walgreens. Uh, that's where I got these from. Uh, for those of you who are new to Blazy Collects, I went to Florida on holiday a few weeks ago, picked up a load of US exclusive stuff, uh, and this is my second box of World Cup stickers. So we've got the Poland Crest, we've got Jorge Sanchez, Mason Mount, Yusef Masakni, and a base Nugamelu of Cameroon. Come on, surely! There's got to be a decent colour parallel coming up soon. Black one of one preferably would be good. Uh, but we'll take what we can get at the moment. Uh, we got Diego Godin. Uh, again, been around for a while. 2005 was his debut. He's been playing for Uruguay for 17 years. That is absolutely mad. Again, I remember him back in the day being a quality defender for Atletico Madrid. Um, and yeah, he's still going for Uruguay. Uh, we got Kamal Miller. We got Araujo, Mike Magnan of France. And the blue to finish is Canadian. Uh, Canadian rookie would be good. Three, two, one. Alfonso Davis, that people is the best blue sticker so far today. Alfonso Davis is a good parallel to get. Young player, a lot of potential, and I think he could light up uh, Canada's performances at the World Cup. Alfonso Davis, blue parallel, uh, is definitely going in a hard sleeve, that one. Look at that people, blue Alfonso Davis. We'll be very careful with that to make sure we can put it in a... Uh, Hard case after the video uh, and make it look nice and pristine. Look at this, people. I've decided against sticking blues into my album at the moment. If I get loads of blues that I know need uh, as we open these boxes, I'll do an album full of blues. But at the moment, I'm going to do an album full of white borders and then a blue, bo uh, a blue border album if I get enough of these stickers. So Orlando Galo uh, of Costa Rica to start. We've got Talibi of Tunisia. We've got the Costa Rican emblem, I believe, with that one. A coke of Spain, and we finish off. Oh, blue Brazilian, blue Brazilian. Could we have decent blue pools back to back? Neymar, we're looking for Nene. Uh, I'm going to say Nene, or oh, who else would we like? Marquinhos would be good as well. Birthday night. Oh, it's not going to be good. It's Thiago Silva. Look at that. I guessed it from the birthday. A blue Thiago Silva uh, sticker. So two decent blues back to back right there. We are taking both of those ones. Neymar would have been cracking. A blue Neymar. would rather a black Neymar because I can imagine that's going to do very, very well uh, if you get it graded, but it is what it is. Uh, we've got Frankie de Jong of the Netherlands, Joe Allen, Jesus Ferreira, Oscar Durate, and a Romain Sace. So nothing decent in that pack right there, people. I reckon we're about halfway through today's video. So that means around 20 odd packs, people, to find a black one-of-one -one sticker. Can we do it? In the second half of today's video. Let's find out people. Next pack is coming up. Next pack is coming up. Is there something decent hiding away for us right here? We got Chris Richards. Samuel Petit. Moreira. Moreira of Costa Rica. Darwin Nunez. Uh, missing for Liverpool this weekend of his injury. It's a blue. A blue England. Hey I think it's Jaden Sancho. 3-2-1. No. Blue Bukayo Saka. That's very good as well. We are taking a blue Bakayo Saka all day. Alfonso Davis, Saka, two young players with blue parallel stickers. That is a good one as well. One of the better blue stickers you can get uh, in this collection. That is going hard sleeve as well. Look at that, people. Um, some good blue stickers there all of a sudden. You can tell, you know, they're hiding away in the middle. Maybe that means the rarer parallels are going to be in the middle of this box. Let's take a look. I've already dropped Matt Turner. I've already dropped the tripod. This is all going wrong, people. It's all going wrong, people. So let's continue this video with another Matt Turner of the USA. Hans Vanneken of Belgium. We've got Edson Alvarez. Benjamin Pavard scored that weldy at the Euros. Uh, and a Wu Young Jung. Sorry, Pavard was actually at the 2018 World Cup, that weldy. Uh, I remember playing a FIFA Ultimate Team 2018 World Cup edition. That was honestly so much fun. That's what got me back into Ultimate Team hard. Uh, was the World Cup version. Uh, and fingers crossed the World Cup version is decent this year as well because I thought um, it was a lot of fun last time. The standalone mode was good as well because the season had finished. I hope it's a standalone mode again this time. Uh, so we've got Mehdi Taremi of Iran, Mateus Oliveira, the Argentinian team, Ethan Ampadu, 
and a Juranovic base to finish off that pack. Still nothing better than a blue. Can you believe we still got nothing better than a blue so far in today's video? Come on! These parallels are hiding somewhere. Let's see if it's this pack, people. We've got Nogmelu. We've got Mickey Yamane. We've got Joel Campbell. We've got Budiaf. A blue Swiss. Don't think it's going to be anyone too special. 1997. They're relatively young. Gibriel Sau of Switzerland is our next blue sticker. Right. Not many to go now, people. Not many to go at all as we carry on ripping our way through this album. Let's take a look and see what... I saw a glimpse of red. We've got a red sticker in this one, people. So let's see what our first decent parallel of the day is. We've got Fabinho. We've got Hongla. We've got a Kellen Acosta. We've got Pablo Sarabia. And our red is a team. What team do we think it is, people? What team do we think it is? There's some yellow. It was Brazil, I think. Is it Brazil? It is! Our first red of the day is the Brazilian national team. And red stickers are every one in 26 packs. We should get two in this box. Uh, you can see Paqueta there. We've got Rafinha, Neymar. Uh, my boy Bruno sadly isn't in that photo because of what a Donny he is. But we've got the Brazilian national team. Is our first red sticker in today's video. Um, I was hoping for something better than that. A team red isn't great, is it, people? It's still got Nene on it, uh, for example. If Brazil win the World Cup, uh, it actually could be quite a decent sticker to have in hand. So we'll definitely hard sleeve it uh, and see what happens here at the World Cup. So we've got the Saudi Arabian badge, I believe, to start off this pack. Definitely is. There's a Saudi. Uh, we've got Salman Al Faraj. We've got Zivkovic. We've got Adam Target, Taggart and a Costa Rican. Don't know him. Ricardo Blanco, another blue for the collection. Keeping it going, people. Keeping it going. Surely there's some more decent parallels to be had. Come on, people. Next pack. We've got Tejeda of Costa Rica, Amala of Morocco, Jonathan David. It's a blue boy. Virgil van Dijk, a blue Polish person. Hoping it's Lewandowski. Could be. July 92. Oh, could be. Should it was Lewandowski? 3-2-1. Ah, Beresinski of Poland. I was hoping we might have a lure there, uh, but it wasn't to be. Bartosz Beresinski of Poland is our next blue. Look at all those blues. They do look good, don't they, people? I'd love, honestly, guys, to do a whole binder full of blue stickers. Uh, it would look really, really cool. So, Yunus Musa, the Canadian team, the Argentinian crest. We are taking that one. And Golo Kante, I think he's going to miss the World Cup with injury, which is gutting for him, gutting for France, gutting for Chelsea. Huge blow uh, to everyone involved right there. South Korean, Song Hyun Min. 3-2-1. Oh, it's not South Korean. I read the badge wrong. Uh, we got Al Makli of Saudi Arabia. It's because it's, um, I thought KSA, Re Korea Republic. Korea Republic. Or is it KR? Oh, I can't remember the Korean, um, the Korean letters. But that's why it was South Korea. But it is what it is. We've got a blue Abdullah Al Malki of Saudi Arabia. God, you can tell the fatigue's kicking in, kicking in now, people. I did an hour and 15 minute live stream yesterday, and here we are filming another video today. I do not know how we are doing this. Uh, we've got Skoripski of Poland. We've got Khalid Zadeh of Iran. Gibriel Sal. Oh, purple at last. And it's a dead player. And it's a dead player. No, he's not dead. It's just not the best player. It's Carlos Grezo of Ecuador. I don't know anything about him. Purples are 1 in 205. Yeah. Ah, uh, purple sticker. It fell away. It just appeared there all of a sudden, didn't it? Purple, 1 in 205 packs. Carlos Grezo uh, of Ecuador. Won't be holding on to him. Uh, if I can sell him for a couple of quid on eBay, we'll definitely be selling him to reinvest in more stickers. But yeah, ah. Uh, Ronaldo or someone would have been absolutely crazy with a purple sticker right there, but it is what it is. God, you can sense the disappointment. We've got Trent Sainsbury there, uh, same name as a supermarket here in the UK. Oh, right, we've got Puchas of Poland. I'm frustrated. Joe Rondon, the Serbian badge and the Qatar Blue national team. Eee, oh, God, I'm so frustrated. I'm so frustrated, people. Why, 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 Delilah, was that not... Uh, a black parallel. I don't even just a purple player that would be worth more, but it is what it is. We've got a shower. Keeping it going, keeping it going. Compose yourself, Matt. Kayla Navas. We've got the Denmark badge. We've got Ganem 
and a blue to finish from Belgium. Kevin De Bruyne would be nice. I think it is. Blue Kevin De Bruyne. At least we've got a decent blue boy right there, people. Blue Kevin De Bruyne is up next from the opening. So golds are going to have to get shuffled out the way again. Look at this. There's just so many coloured parallels out there, including a purple. Including the purple. I'm not bitter about it, people. I'm not bitter about it, people. Maybe I am just a little bit bitter about it. Um, but hey, I'm just going to take a look quickly, people. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Twelve packs. Twelve packs to find a black one of one. Just because we found a purple right now doesn't mean this video is over, people. It doesn't mean anything. These are randomly shuffled packs. Surely there's a big boy still hiding here. Timothy Weyer, very badly printed. You can see the borders all over the place there. Uh, we got Alfredo Tavela, Jules Kunde, Daniel Kofi Kare, and a blue Jordan Pickford to end off that pack. Um, as a Newcastle fan, I think you can tell how I feel about Jordan Pickford. Just going to move our little uh, thing into focus. Uh, but hey, not a bad player. A lot worse blues you can get than Jordan Pickford, isn't there? Um, funny coming from a Newcastle fan, that isn't it as well? Bet you're surprised. So we've got Fred of Brazil, Pierre Kunde of Cameroon, Stefan Bahoken of Cameroon, double Cameroons back to back. We've got Zielenski and a base Neko Williams. Nothing going there for us, people. Nothing going there. Next pack coming up right now. Let's be taking a look, people. Let's be taking a look. We've got Jen Strieger Larson. We've got the Al Thumana Stadium in Qatar. Francisco Calvo, Memphis Depay, and the German national team. Keeping these last ones going. We're going at some speed now, people. Come on. Surely one more big hit is going to behest us in today's video. We've got the Moroccan crest right there. Add that to the crest pile. We've actually got no golden historical stickers in today's video, if anyone's noticed. That's not a great return, is it, from one box? Uh, maybe they're in the last few packs, but let's see. We've got Kuki. We've got John Stones. We've got Dignek. And a blue to finish from Qatar. It is Karim Boudiath of Qatar. Uh, another blue sticker. Look at all those blues. Got the purple Carlos Grezo right there. Come on, next one up, people. Surely we've got a big boy coming. Here we go, people. Here we go. Paul Pogba, Lewis Romo, Skimanski, Jonathan Williams, and a base Harry Wilson. A very Wales heavy pack right there, wasn't it? Oh, we want one more decent parallel. One more decent parallel. Come on. Come on. We're not picky. We're not being picky right now. Well, we are being picky because we're a black one on one, but hey. So, next pack Majid Hosseini, Wade Hennessy, Juan Pablo Vargas, Rafael Guerrero, Ecuador player, Alexander Doming Dominguez, Dominguez of Ecuador. You could tell I couldn't pronounce that there. We've opened so many packs. We've opened over 40 packs for today's video. Whew. I am getting a little bit tired right now, people. I'm flagging a little bit. Right, and the Liverpool games, I have no idea what the score is. Uh, we've got Hyong Song Min. We've got Benete, Naya Fagued, the Belgian Crest, a blue to finish from Ecuador, double Ecuador blues, uh, Moises Casiedo of Ecuador. That's three Ecuadorian parallels in today's box. Uh, very good if you're an Ecuador fan, by the way. I wonder if there is someone out there collecting blue par uh, purple parallels, because if so, there'll be someone out there that's after Grezo, hopefully. Uh, and we can get a little bit of money in to get more of these boxes to rip open. So, Celso Borges. Um, I just realised I put the Belgian crest in the wrong place there. That's not good for my organisation. Uh, we've got on here, Vittoria. We've got Kabi, Ayla Militao, Paul Pogba. And that's it from that pack. That is it from that pack. No coloured parallel hiding there. Guys, four packs to go. Four packs to go. Is this the end? Surely we have something decent that we're going to pack in these last few packs. Donya Marlin, Connor Roberts, Svidersky, the Tunisian crest, a blue, Argentina, he's too young to be Messi, Dybala. Leandro Paredes is our next blue of the day. The golds are going to have to come out of view here. Stick in Paredes on there. Slide these across one more time. That's probably as good as we're going to get, people. What have we got now? Final ones coming up here, people. Final ones. Three more packs. Three more chances. Uh, a decent kind of parallel. I think we have another purple. I think we might have another purple here, people. Wow. Two purple stickers from today's video. Look at this. Surely it's better than Ecuador. Come on, people. Hassan. Rabio. Vlasic. Medibo. 
It is someone born in 98, young player for Spain. This could be a good one. This could be a good one. Three, two, one. Danny, Danny Olmo. Danny Olmo. It's all right. It's a better nation than um, Ecuador, isn't it? But imagine if that had been a Gavi, a Gavi Spanish sticker, for example. Purple would have been unreal. Um, but hey, these are two, one in 205 packs. So these are actually really, really rare. So to get two blue, well, two purple parallels in one box um, is a pretty good return, to be fair. I've got two reds in the last box. We've got two purples uh, so far in this box. I hope that's not it, people, but I'm not feeling confident from two more packs. Two more packs coming up here, people. What have we got? Let's be taking a look here, people. This one's got stuck all over the place. It's ruined the opening because we know there's no parallel in here. Let's see what is going on, people. We've got Mignolet. We've got Carney. We've got Castelletto. Mirami. I'm just getting through this one. Talking Hazard. Uh, as we go into the final pack here, people. Final pack. Final shot at something good from today's video. Let's be taking a look. We've got the other IU brother, Alejandro Gomez, Abubakar, Kier, and bye. No more colour parallels, people. And that is it. We have got from this video two purples, one red, uh, as well as if we just shuffle things out, just so I can see what I've got a little bit clearer. Uh, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven, fourteen, twenty-one. Uh, 25, 26 blues as well. A better return than last time, to be fair. So give us a second to sort out this mess and we are going to summarise today's video. So that is it, people. Look at that on the board, people. We got so many blue parallels from today's video, as was expected. And unfortunately, we were very unsuccessful in that hunt for a black one of one. We did not get a black one of one, but in the end, we got rarer parallels inside box number two than we managed inside box number one. They were not the biggest hits, but we got some nice little stickers to take a look through here. We've got our purple one in 205 packs, Danny Olmo, followed by a Carlos Grezo purple. So two purples, which should be, you know, 410 packs. We only opened 50 today. We've got the one in 26 uh, red Brazilian sticker as well, which hopefully if Brazil win the World Cup, could be a spicy little addition to someone's collection. We've got a Bakayu Saka. I had to sleeve him because of his potential. We've got Kevin De Bruyne. You guys know why I sleeved that one. And again, Alfonso Davis. Canada's first World Cup in a while. I think he could light things up. Uh, so some very nice stickers that we put away inside our sleeves. We've also added that, you know, to our red Bale, red Valverde, red Lo Celso, and blue Alexander Arnold. So plenty of stickers now in hard sleeves. I wasn't planning on hard sleeving a lot this year, people. But with the World Cup, you never quite know what is going to happen, do you? So we have got plenty in the collection now, uh, and they are going to probably work their way onto eBay at some point, uh, depending on what happens over the next couple of weeks in the World Cup. So that is all she wrote with today's video, people. It was an L in terms of finding a black parallel, but we got some nice little collateral uh, with those two purple stickers and some really nice rookie blues too. So fingers crossed, people, we can get even more lucky when we rip open our third box of World Cup stickers. But for now, people, that is the end of today's video. And if you guys enjoyed today's video, then please smash that like button to let me know. Do comment and let me know what you thought of my polls. And do subscribe not to miss our next World Cup sticker opening and all the crazy stuff we are going to be opening over the next few weeks of the World Cup. We've got Prison World Cup coming, Mosaic World Cup, new match attacks update packs. There is so much coming to the channel. Uh, it's going to be an unbelievable few weeks. But for now, people, have a lovely evening and I will catch you on the next video.